This is Dallas, that giant truck. It's like a foot taller than I am, and I'm not short. is everything. Did 8.18 miles at a 7 minute 11 second per mile pace. I went a little quicker than I planned on. And now, cue the intro. Actually, a little bit of a false alarm. All right, one small puppy Cool. Right Thanks so much. First, I needed to grab some dog food for my mom. Go back home really quick. Then I can go look for food. Just walked in there. It's a craft store. And I was like, hi, I'm looking for some food that's on hold. And she's like, you're looking for some what? I meant to go in there. The pet um, I haven't decided where I'm going to go. I originally planned on going to a Russian bakery, but I might have to change and go to a cookie place. Um, see, this might kind of sound weird, but living in Asia, I don't miss American food because it's easier to find, like steak or chicken or hamburgers, or you can cook it yourself. It's not that hard to find. Um, what is hard to find is certain international foods, Russian foods, African foods, like Eritrean or Ethiopian food. So I have a craving for some Russian baked goods because they have really good pastry. So I was looking, but I couldn't find any Russian pastry shops or bakeries here in Dallas. The best I could find was like a European deli. I don't know if I should risk going up there because it's rush hour traffic right now. It'll take maybe 30 minutes to get there. Or if I should go to this really, 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 really good cookie place. Okay, I decided going to the European bakery place. English toffee, oh, yeah. Oreo delight, black forest, cherry brandy, amaretto truffle, rocky road, Bailey's truffle, rum truffle. Get the Florentine, please. Dark chocolate tequila for sure. How about a English toffee? Saying that in the morning, there's a ton of stuff. I'm here like 45 minutes before they close, so I'll have to come back another day, but usually there's tons of cakes and lots more pastry. Thank you so much.
chocolate English toffee. Awesome texture. The toffee's perfectly crunchy in the middle. Florentine. Mmm. Crunchy, light, flaky, not too sweet, not too tart. Really, really, really nice. Not heavy. It'd be good in the afternoon. It wouldn't put you off for a few hours. Truffle. I forgot the I forgot the flavor. Oh, tequila truffle. This is thick. It's good though. Reminds me of being at the beach, making bad decisions. This is my princess room because I'm a princess. Today was kind of something I wanted to try and start doing. So once a week I'll talk about running, once a week I'll talk about food. Uh, I'll still try and make these every day. Um, and when I talk about food, I'm gonna try and find a place that's really unique and interesting. And uh, I'm gonna try and find a, like, a, like a special characteristic or something unique um, that you wouldn't normally experience just going in and buying something, like something you'd have to kind of ask around. So tonight I found out that that place had like these 40 year old recipes um, that were that are from the Netherlands and there's people that have been going there like every week um, to get the same cookie and stuff, which I thought was pretty cool. But I'm gonna start doing these daily. So I'm really gonna try to do daily vlogs um, just to kind of, it's fun for me, I like it, it's creative, and it's fun kind of showing people stuff. And hopefully you guys like it too. All right, uh, it's late, good night, see ya. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.